business in 1962. We are just about ready for baseball from Dodger Stadium in Los Angeles. The Midsummer Classic between the American League All-Stars and the National League All-Stars. Hi again, everybody. Matt Vaskersian. Welcome to our special coverage of the Major League Baseball All-Star Game here on the show. I'll be joined in the booth by Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, but before we turn to them, let's check out the starters for this year's American and National League All-Star teams. Final preparations being made down on the field. We've got a fun night in store. It's the Major League All-Star Game on the show, and it comes your way next. Trying here to plate the tying run from the second. Baseman, Gerald He set and the pitch. Ball that's in. Hey, this pitcher's gonna have to step off the mound right here and refocus. Go, Take go. a deep breath, something. Can't keep falling behind and creating traffic. It puts everybody on edge, not only himself. This ball All gets right, down. Up, Let's see up. if they try to score. Won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one away. That's a big at bat from the bottom of the order. Yeah, Matty, right there. Worked himself into a nice situation. Got on, on base right there. Now first and third. Rolls the lineup over. Top of the order is Rick and his chops. The first baseman. Striding five. in is Freddie, Freddie Freeman. Trying to bring in the Freeman. time run from third here. Here's a look over first. And they got him. So a man at second here with two away. And up next, the former World Series hero, Salvador Perez. Swinging a soft liner. Throw the first, beats him easily, and the side is retired. So no runs here on a base hit, no errors, and one man left the board. To the bottom of inning number four we go, and we are tied 2-2. Digging in, the switch header, Gerald who collected a base hit his first time up. From the stretch. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Hayden is unlike many of today's hitters in the sense that he doesn't have a lot hey, of swing go, and miss in his approach right at the plate. Here. More often than not, he gets contact, and I'm sure that makes him a frustrating hitter to face from a pitcher's standpoint. You know, he takes his chances when he has count leverage. Without question, 1 0, 2 0. You'll see this guy try and get nasty a little bit, but he stays within himself. Outside. He knows what his strengths are, and he tries to drive the ball right back where it came from. Good plate discipline to lay off the slider that time, and he draws even a 2 and 2. He went with the off speed there once he got him to 0 and 2, but now that they both missed, I think we'll see more of a challenge pitch here. You don't have to give in, but you can't be too cute either. The 2-2. And he fouls this one off. Hey, like the 2-2 two -two one more time. Line drive to center field. And that Come finds on, find some it, outfield grass. It, it's it. a base hit. All right, get it back. Hey guys, this, he's not known for being a singles hitter right here, but that's his second knock of the game. And I'm sure he'll take him, but the guys on the other side of the scorecard might be thinking, who really avoided a worse fate? 
So next up will be Freddie Freeman. Previously against Carlos Radon. He's got three for four. He's also hit a couple of home runs against him. Freddie with the one and two. And the slider gets him swinging to God. Really impressive pitching right there. Sometimes as a pitcher, you can get frustrated when you make a good pitch and you don't get that call from the umpire. But what does he do? He comes back with a good pitch and gets the strike. And a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. And don't forget, he gave up a long ball earlier in this inning, so you can understand why he wasn't too aggressive with him there. When he got him to three and one, he wasn't too anxious to challenge him. The right field. Here's Bryce three. Harper now. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. Harper. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. So two runs on three hits, including the home run. No errors and two left. On to the top of inning number five we go. The NL leads it four to two. Now at the plate, now Gerald Hayden singled in his last at bat. First pitch of the A.B. now. Now ball here's one, a slider that can't quite get back to the outside corner. It's ball one. Hey, a two-out walk right here would be the time run to the plate. Even though it's early on, you got a guy on deck that has a lot of pop. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And another base hit for him as he's gone three for three in this one. Boy, just when you're looking for one of those shutdown innings, you get two quick outs, D roll, then you give up a two out base hit to extend the inning. Yeah, you show me a, a big league ball player that's going to give away an AB, no chance. Everybody's in there grinding every at bat, every plate appearance. Nice job, maybe a little two out light to start. Number five. Ready. Here's the first baseman, Freddie Freeman. Freeman. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Field, field, Runners field. on the move for second. Fly ball out to straightaway right field. No trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. We're through six full. It's the American League six and the National League four. Now at the plate, here is Gerald Hayden trying to stay perfect. He's three for three so far. Up there, huh? He's set. Here it comes. Lined is short, but gobbled up there, and there are two away. Your attention, please. You're sitting to the American region. Number 47. Chaos Girl. Hit on the ground toward the left. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So no runs here, no hits, no errors, and one man left on base. Two, three, and four set to kick off the bottom of the ninth. It's the American League eight and the National League six. Wow, plenty of runs to go around in this one. Not a great day to be a pitcher, that's for sure. These hitters looked like they knew it was coming as soon as the ball was coming out of the hand. A wild game indeed. Eight to six, the final score tonight. The American League All-Stars get the win on the heels of four home runs. Nate Valdi is credited with.